Escondido, California. Over the past three decades our immersion has fitted braces for everyone from Paralympians to children with scoliosis. But Mzatuni was a patient like none other, a newborn giraffe. The calf was born February 1st at the San Diego Zoo Safari Park in Escondido, north of San Diego, with her front limb bending the wrong way. Zoo staff feared she could die if they didn't immediately correct the condition, which could prevent her from nursing and walking around the habitat. But they had no experience with fitting a baby giraffe in a brace. That proved especially challenging given she was a 5 foot 10 inch tall, 178 centimeter, newborn and growing taller every day. So, they reached out to experts in orthotics at the hangar clinic, where Merzen landed his very first animal patient. It was pretty surreal when I first heard about it, Merzen told the Associated Press this week during a tour to meet Mzatuni, who was strutting alongside the other giraffes with. Of course, all I did was go online and study giraffes for like 24-7 until we got out here. Zoos increasingly are turning to medical professionals who treat people to find solutions for ailing animals. The collaboration has been especially helpful in the field of prosthetics and orthotics. Earlier this year, Zoo Tampa in Florida teamed up with similar experts to successfully replace the beak of a cancer-stricken great hornbill bird with a 3D printed prosthetic. The hangar team in California had fit orthotics for a cyclist and kayaker who both went on to win medals at the 2016 Paralympics in Brazil and customized a brace for a marathoner with multiple sclerosis who raced in seven continents. And in 2006, a hangar team in Florida created a prosthetic for a bottlenose dolphin that had lost its tail after becoming tangled in ropes from a crab trap, 